in this video today we will see why you are not receiving the text messages from the default text messaging app in your Samsung phone but instead of that you are receiving from the third party application now the first thing that you will do is you will go to settings here you will go down and open these apps tap on these three dotted icons here go to default apps and tap on this option messaging app now here you need to make sure that you have selected the default Samsung messaging app as a default messaging app in your iPhone now the other thing that you can do is you can also tap on this three dotted icons here select this option reset app preferences now what happens is whatever customizations you have done everything will be reset back to the original settings just take care that if you have customized other applications also then it will be reset to the factory default so if you want you can select this option reset now after this also if nothing happens then what you can do is again go to settings here go to this apps again then scroll down and you have to open the default messaging app open it select storage select clear cache and then clear data and ok so once you have done these things then you should be getting text messages from the default messaging app in your Samsung phone still if nothing happens then what you can do is you can wipe out the cache partition in your Samsung phone maybe because of the corrupt cache partition the issue is occurred so for that one what you have to do is you have to at first power off your phone so tap and hold on this button here which is power on off button select power off and then power off again now once the phone is completely off what you have to do is you have to press this power on off button Bixby button and volume off button at the same time so press and hold these three buttons together you have to leave these buttons when you see this Samsung logo when the Samsung logo appears remove it and your phone will start in recovery mode so just wait for a few seconds so there are some menus here and there is one option here wipe cache partition so if you have to go down and select that option you have to press this volume down so the selection will move down so I have selected this option wipe cache partition in order to activate the menu you have to press this power on off button so let me press it now it is asking me whether I want to wipe out the cache partition I have to select yes so I will press this volume down button in order to select the option yes and in order to activate the option I have to press this power on off button so I will press it now the cache partition is wiped and reboot system now is automatically selected so press this power on off button so as to restart your phone and once you restart the phone you should be getting the text messages from the default messaging app in your Samsung phone now instead of doing all of these things what you can do is you can remove the third party messaging application from your Samsung phone so that you will get the message from the default messaging app this process is only required if you want to keep both of the messaging app in your phone thank you for watching this video please like and comment on the video if you found it helpful also click on the subscribe button and hit on the bell icon to get the notification of our latest videos for free